reporter Bryce Onslinger is live with what's happening right now. Bryce? Well, that's right, Clyde and Carol. I just talked to attorney Mike <coughs> Allen here at his law office in Kenwood. He's representing about 300 of those drivers who have received tickets in Elmwood Place that you mentioned. And uh, he is taking this before a judge saying that what's happening is illegal. He wants to put a restraining order out on all current citations so that the courts can decide if this is legal. Now, those cameras are still up in Elmwood Place right now. And so far, they've generated about one point, uh, 100, uh, I should say $1.5 million in total have been generated from the cameras, $1.5 million. Um, if you're caught speeding, it's a $105 fine. And so far, Allen says uh, he's making his case that the cameras are unconstitutional. What we are trying to show, and I think we did show, that the speed camera program in Elmwood is being operated without due process of law. People cannot subpoena witnesses to the hearings. Uh, there's no evidence that the devices are properly calibrated, and it's nothing more than a money grab. And Alan told me that some of the most important testimony on his side was from a, uh, a reverend in Elmwood Place who says his parishioners uh, are not coming to church anymore because they're scared of getting a ticket. A judge will make a decision on whether the current citations will be uh, held out until a court decides if this is legal. He'll make that decision on January 24th. Bryce Onslinger, 9 News, live in Kenwood. Thank you, Bryce.